Canadians know the feeling, a cough that just won't quit. I still have it. <laughs> yeah, it comes and goes. I do normally wait it out myself. Uh, if it were to last for weeks, though, I would definitely go into the doctor. Usually, um, you know, home remedies. So like hot water, you know, mixed with turmeric. That's what we do in our culture. <coughs> so what's the best way to tackle a <laughs> nagging cough? A trio of doctors writing Monday in the Canadian Medical Association Journal say if a cough follows an infection, it's usually just a waiting game. We look through the evidence of what can be used to treat or stop a ghost infectious cough. And the answer, surprisingly, is time and patience. This family doctor says he's only talking about cases where someone had a known viral infection beforehand, like a cold or the flu. Most of the time, the patient's own cough will resolve on its own without any medication or treatment. But it lasts a lot longer than you think, anywhere from three to eight weeks in total. But if a cough lasts beyond two months, it can signal a deeper health issue. Physicians say other red flags can include coughing up blood, shortness of breath, wheezing, or difficulty swallowing. In those cases, conditions like asthma, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, or COPD, or even whooping cough could be the culprit. And you might need treatment like an inhaler or other medications. If the cough has been persistent for up to six to eight weeks, um, then at least to do a basic chest x-ray to make sure there's no underlying serious underlying lung disease. Doctors say getting a proper diagnosis is important, but for most run-of-the-mill coughs caused by a virus, there's not much they can do. So the advice is just wait it out. Lauren Pelly, CBC News, Toronto.